many questions, too many licenses, too many regulations ended stifling these businesses. And therefore, if you look at the trajectory of India economic history post-independence, 1948, I'm not going to elaborate why I have picked off these years. You'll know it. Honorable members know it. 1948, 1955, 1969, and it peaked in 1975, all of which were strongly socialist, not truly the kind of socialism which the Western nations or even Russia spoke about, but a hybrid kind of a socialism, ending the Indian entrepreneur's capacity to take this economy along. And it is that which the same party, which between 48 and 75, happily took upon itself, 1991. I concede it was under duress. Shifts from the socialism to complete opening up of the economy and also till today, rightly take the credit, I have no problem. And till today, would like to harp on, oh, 1991, it is we who opened up the economy, it is we who have given you a free market approach and it is we who are reformist. The very same party, sir, from 48, which constricted the Indian economy, in 91 says, no, we've opened up, we've given reform, and repeatedly asks us, asks Prime Minister, where is your reform credential? What have you done in reform? Repeatedly asks. 